All right, guys, we've been raising these turtles in the dirt for the whole summer, right? Mm -hmm. Uh huh. And they just started to hatch. How many do we have so far? Three. 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 Are you guys going to name them? Uh -huh. Yes. This one's Skylar, that one's Larkin, and that one's Connor. What? Skylar, Connor. And Larkin. What? All right. Do you guys know what kind of snapping turtles these are? What? Do you want to know? Uh huh. They're called common snapping turtles. Will they bite us if we wash them? These little baby ones aren't going to bite you, but a big one could bite you. Okay? Just like the one in the wayside inn. Yeah, that was a big one that tried to bite Connor. Yeah. So I'm going to teach you a little bit of science facts about turtles, and then I'm going to let you touch them a little bit, okay? Uh-huh. Okay? And then I can put him in there. In a bath, okay. Mm -hmm. So first things first, Connor, are you listening? Yeah. Tur these kind of turtles live in Massachusetts, but they also live all the way up in Canada, and they can be found all the way down to Florida. Okay? They have very flexible necks, and it's not safe to pick one up. Connor, no thumb, bud. Okay? It's not safe to pick them up in the wild, okay? Because they can turn their head all the way around both sides of their body to their feet, right? And they can also turn their neck all the way up over their shell, all the way back to their tail, okay? And some people think you can pick them up by their tail, but do you know why you shouldn't do that? Because why? they can stretch their head and snap on you. That's one reason. But those ones won't do it because they're just babies. The other reason you don't do that, right, is because it hurts the turtles. Okay? If you hold the turtle by its tail, it can break its back. No, okay? and it can break its tail. It can break its tail and its whole spinal cord. So these two right here, they came out a little while ago, and they're already wet because we had them in our tank. This guy, he just dug out just now, right? A few minutes ago. How big do you think these are? There's two inches. Two just... inches? That tall, Connor? That's how tall you think they are? That tall. And that tall? Okay, that tall. that's pretty accurate. And that tall. And that tall, Larkin? And that tall. Yep. This tall. <laughs> no. How big no. do you think they can get? This tall. They can get the biggest one ever... The biggest one ever was 86 pounds. Oh my god! Do you guys know how big 86 pounds is? 100 feet. It's like all three of you combined. That would be 100 feet. What do you guys think snapping turtles eat? Lettuce. Fish. 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 Lettuce. lettuce. What do you think, Larkin? What do snapping turtles eat? Lettuce. What? Cake. Lettuce. Cake! <laughs> Alright, well guess what? You're both right. They do eat fish, and they do eat lettuce and vegetables, right? But they, but they also eat, eat frogs yeah. and snakes yeah. and birds, and they even eat mammals. They eat things like uh, squirrels and mice and chipmunks and baby raccoons, and they even eat baby ducks. Oh, you know that? Baby ducks! Yes, they ducks eat baby ducks. So cute. I know. But you know what? Ducks eat baby turtles, so we're even. Bet you didn't know that. Even baby ducks eat baby turtles. <laughs> Do you know what, what these baby turtles eat, though? What? When they're babies? Lettuce. Nope. Why don't you take that new one, Skylar, and flip them over very gently? Carrot. No! It's okay. It's safe. I'm big! You want I to want to do it. You want to do it? I'm big! Very gentle. Flip them over. Oh. Super gentle. Yeah. Yeah. And then look on his belly. And do you see a bumpy thing? Uh-huh. Yeah. Do you know what that is? What? That's called a yolk sac. That's the piece that was inside the egg feeding him to grow. And when they're babies, they keep their yolk sac right on their belly. And that's what they eat all winter long for their first winter when they're hibernating. It's moving. Well, maybe somebody should flip them back over. Larkin, do you want to do it? Perfect. Good job, right? Larkin. Perfect. And you know, you guys, who knows what hibernation is? You do? What is hibernation? When animals go to sleep for the winter. Oh, they slow down? They go, they go to bed in the fall and wake up in spring. Yeah. Do you know why they do that? Because they, couldn't, they can't get food in the winter. Yeah. And they need food to keep them going. That's right. And if they can't get food... They can get very sick or they can die. That's right. 
but these little baby turtles come equipped with their own food, right? And I have something very interesting that I didn't know about snapping turtles. Some of them, when they get older and bigger, they make their own decision not to hibernate. And sometimes they stay awake right underneath the ice in the pond. All through the whole winter, they still swim around underneath the ice. Isn't that crazy? So this is why you're going to go so ice fishing with me. It's, <laughs> yes, it's, I'll go ice fishing with you. It's really weird that yeah. only the queen bee hibernates. Mm. I'm going to flick that. No, don't flick them. Know what we're going to do? We're going to go let them go, okay? So that they can hibernate through the winter, okay? But I have one last trick to teach you about the snapping turtles, mm -hmm. okay? If you see one on the side of the road and you're afraid it's going to get hit by a car, how would you save it if you can't pick it up? You would kick it off the road. Kick it? What if it bit your shoe off? And I don't think kicking it sounds very nice to you. No. What you can do is because they're snappers and they bite, you can take a big stick and put it down next to it and it will bite the stick and hold on and then you can drag it right off the road and it will hold on to the stick with its mouth. Isn't that silly? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now, Skylar said she wanted to give a snapping turtle a bath, so you can pour it nice and gently right on the, the dirty one and clean them up. <laughs> that was kind of silly, huh? Pull up. This guy's moving around a little bit. Which one was this? Don't shake the table, Connor. What's this guy's name? That guy's name? Yeah. Connor. This one's Connor? Of course, Larkin. Of course Connor, Connor would be the one moving around. That moving down. Is he looking? Uh-huh. Hey, Connor. Oh. oh, my God. Oh, my God. He's coming off the floor. Turtles are very slow. Can he get off oh, me? My God. Is he going to get off the plate? Uh-huh. It's okay because it has paper. No way. <laughs> Where's he going? They Where's have, he going, Larkin? They have claws. <laughs> <laughs> they have claws? That's so how weird. How old do you guys think turtles can get? This. Not how big. 100. How old? Years Connor, old. careful. I'm going to touch him. 100 years old. I'm going to touch him. You want to touch him? Uh-huh. Very gentle. Eh. You can touch him. Very gentle. Damn. You want to touch him, Larkin? Very gentle. And Skylar, guess what? You were, Did he try to tuck in his shell? Yes. Do you know what? Snapping yes. turtles actually can't tuck back into their shell. They don't have that power. Only big ones do. Nope, none of them can. Their bodies are too big for their shells. And Skylar, you are exactly right. People say that snapping turtles live just over 100 years. I did not give him a bath. I didn't give him a bath. Oh, you wanted to give him a bath? Uh -huh. How about you can clean him up? Nice and gentle. Napkin on him. Okay, that's good. He's all set. Ew. Ew. Now, there's something important you guys have to do, okay? Mm -hmm. Turtles can carry some diseases, okay? And you guys all put your hands on turtle, right? And then Connor put his hand in his mouth, right? Mm -hmm. So what should we do? Watch out your hands! All right. Skylar already figured it out. Larkin, all right. no. Larkin no mouth. Hey, say goodbye to the turtles. Goodbye, turtles. Say goodbye to the turtles. Goodbye, turtles. Do you love them? Yeah. Say love you, turtles. I love you, turtles. Bye-bye!